In today's video, we're gonna take a look at the Dragon Touch S1 portable monitor. I'd like to thank Dragon Touch for sending this over to review today. It has a 15.6 inch full HD 1080p display. This is a gaming or computer display for laptop, PC, Mac, phones, and gaming devices such as PS3, PS4, Xbox One, a Switch, and there's also a smart cover included. It also has dual speakers. Now this is currently $170 on Amazon, but I'll leave a link in the description below with current pricing and more information. Now this is a really good idea, especially right now when a lot of people are working from home. It never hurts to have a second display, especially one like this, which is easily portable. So let's go ahead and open it up and see what we've got. Oh wow, this thing is super lightweight. Here's the included Padfolio style case. It's a leatherette material on the outside. And then on the inside, it's got a really nice rubber grip to it. So here's your HDMI to mini display port adapter. Wall charger. You can get a two year warranty on this. Quick start guide. You've also got a USB-C to USB-C cable. USB-A to USB-C charging cable, mini HDMI to HDMI cable. You've also got two little screws here. I'm not really sure what those are yet, but I did see two holes on the cover. Like I said, this thing is super lightweight and it's got pretty small bezels on the top and sides. You can see the back of this is metal and there's where the screws go. You've also got a built-in speaker on each side. Down here in the left-hand corner, you've got a menu button and volume controls. And then down at the bottom on the left hand side is all of your ports, including charging port, two USB-C ports, and a mini HDMI port. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and get this connected and see what it looks like. So to hold the case slash stand on, you just screw these right into the back, which is definitely gonna hold it in place for sure. It's just hopefully you don't lose these. And then you've got these little pieces here that stop it from sliding. So overall, it gives you three different viewing positions. Not too bad, I would say. One nice feature of the display is it's got a matte finish, so there's almost no reflections on the screen, and it has really good viewing angles. The first thing I did was hook it up to my cell phone and play some Call of Duty Mobile, and I gotta say, this looks really good. So playing mobile games on a large screen is always so much better in my opinion. This is really good, especially for games that you can use a controller on. I didn't notice any lag or any glitches while playing. So whether you're gonna use this for modern games or retro games, I think this display works really good. I hooked up my Super Nintendo Classic, which I haven't played for a while. And yeah, it looks really good on here as well. Watch me let Bob Charlie think he's gonna win against me. Sorry, Charlie. I even used this monitor for an upcoming video using my Switch I just bought recently. And again, the resolution and viewing angles look really good on here. I think this is a good monitor for any gaming system that uses HDMI. Here's some more game footage just to give you an idea of what it looks like. So hopefully this video gave you a little more info on the Dragon Touch S1 portable monitor. I feel the screen is plenty bright enough and has good viewing angles for most use cases. 
Plus the speakers on here seem plenty loud enough. I think overall if you're looking for a portable gaming monitor or you just need a larger screen for a tablet or even just working from home like a lot of people are doing here recently and you need a second screen, I think you should definitely consider the Dragon Touch S1 portable monitor. So if you've made it this far into the video, you may want to say thanks by subscribing and don't forget to give a thumbs up if this video was helpful. This is Brian from Fishbee Productions. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.